Revideo only outputs at 25 frames per second unless you are on the top package where you can pick your frame rate. In my first video, part one, I looked at what happened when I used non 25 frame per second video and I output it using Revideo. Now I used static shots only. In this video, I'm gonna be using moving subjects. So let's start off with 25 frames per second. So there's gonna be a lot of movement in this clip. I'm gonna be winding the car up and then moving it along. And the footage looks fine. Now I'm gonna use 50 frames per second, which should look okay because it's a multiple of 25. And the 50 frames per second looks fine as well for movement. Now I'm gonna use 24 frames per second. Now 24 frames per second will look probably very, very close to 25 frames per second, although it's not quite there. Now when we get to 30 frames per second, we do have a problem. It does start to look jittery. And when we get to 60 frames per second, we still have a jittery look to the video. You have to be on the top package if you want to use video that isn't 25 frames per second without consequence. 